So I just finished my PhD recently, and it's really exciting to see my work or see my work and the work of my colleagues honored in this in this way. It's been great to meet it, meet with everybody here. Um, I just like to highlight a couple aspects of my work. So. First off, it's one of the few studies that looks at connectivity in coral reefs, and in particular, it highlights um, the different networks that exist in reef systems. So it basically delineates where, where those networks are and which reefs are connected to which other reefs, and that helps us understand um, kind of how to structure guideline, guidelines for um, global conservation initiatives. So it helps us understand which countries maybe should be working together or which areas should be working together. Um, and in particular, it highlights these six major worldwide networks that um, one of them encompasses a huge amount of the Indo-Pacific and that kind of illustrates the importance of working together to conserve these great ecosystems. Another part of this study um, looked at the ability of the reefs which are currently prioritized for conservation um, and their capacity for reseeding the networks worldwide or reseeding potentially, or receding all the other reefs worldwide. Um, and we find that they leave massive gaps in the reefs that they recede, which kind of highlights why we need to be thinking about connectivity, and why we need to be thinking about networks, because it highlights that we need to be finding where these stepping stone reefs are um, and seeing where we should be, which other reefs we should be prioritizing in order to allow um, the processes that already exist, this larval dispersal, to recede all reefs worldwide. Um, and what's really exciting about this work is that I worked on it in collaboration with um, Emily Darling, who's the Global Director for Coral Reef Research at Wildlife Conservation Society, and she's been um, really pushing this work on the international stage, and it now is the centerpiece of, or is a huge, sorry, is a huge part of the Wildlife Conservation Society's worldwide coral reef strategy um, to basically find these stepping stone reefs and also prioritize these reef networks. And she's also, it's also been key to the UN's um, coral reef initiatives. And so that's really exciting to see for me as somebody who's just starting off in science to see that my work is um, having these impacts worldwide. Um, and I think the great thing about this prize is that it gives the work more exposure and hopefully it can lead to um, greater capacity to conserve coral reefs worldwide and help the billions of people that rely on them for sustenance. Um, and so I'm excited to connect with more researchers over this work and continue this work on um, into the future.